Hi friends. Hi friends. Hi, hi, hi. Hey friends. friends. Welcome to a special late night episode of Dan's, Dan's Secret, Secret Random, Random Scales. Scales. Tonight we're going to go over one of the ultimate guitar scales. My favorite scale. Lydia Dominant. Travel back, will you? With me? To when we went over the major scale. The major scale was comprised of seven unique tones and then the octave. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. But now we're working on the Lydian dominant scale. And to make that happen, we're gonna take our major scale and change two of the notes. Can you tell which two we're changing? Here's the major scale. Now here's the Lydian dominant scale. If you said we changed the note A, you're wrong. The difference between the major scale and the Lydian dominant scale is that we raise the fourth a half step, F, F sharp, and lower the seventh a half step, B, B flat. That's it! C, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B flat, C. It looks like this. C, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B flat, C. C, B flat, A, G, F sharp, E, D, C. Let's look at that in another position. Root, two, three, sharp four, five, six, flat seven, root. You might be wondering, what, what, what am I supposed to do with this scale? What do you want to do with this scale? When can I use this scale? Anytime. But it sounds really great over major chords. For example, a C major chord. I mean, that makes sense because we're playing in C and you still have the major third, E. How's that gonna sound? Let's, let's check it out. I'm gonna make a loop of a C major chord, and then I'm gonna play the scale on top of that loop. Let's hear how it sounds, shall we? Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us on a special late night edition of Dan's, Dan's Secret, Secret Random, Random Scales. Scales. We'll see you next time.
circles! Lydian Dominant!